Hi everybody, I'm Graham McCown. So in this video, I wanted to talk about how I created this image for a past event of mine called the Concept to Camera Challenge. How the workshop worked is that everybody was given a concept challenge that they had to shoot. There were simpler ideas and more complex ideas. This image was created for the explainer video and it was the simplest concept that I had and I decided to use that to show that even the simple ideas can have a great execution. The concept for this shot was to show a visual link between two photographs. Here is the set I created for the test shot. Some things I bought from a used store and others I created like the vintage light stand that's on the ground. There's no real secret to the set, I just wanted to have a vintage vibe. I used two 220 watt standard studio flashes, one with a 120 centimeter octobox as the key light and the other using barn doors as a rim light. The link I was going to use was going to be created by using a vintage telephone, the base being in one shot and the handset being in another. First I set about directing the model and making final touches to the set. Here you can see how I used my second boom stand to hold the handset of the telephone. I shot repeatedly until I felt I had the shot and the model was more settled into her pose. Once I was happy, I smoked the scene and shot the final image. I repeated this process for the second image, which unfortunately only later did I notice that my filming camera gave out, so I don't have any footage of us actually taking that second image, but it was the same process. The final step is creating the shot in Photoshop. I clone stamped out the cord from the top image and extended the cord from the bottom image and finally placed them together. Lastly, I did a solo shot of the bottom image as I wanted to have a shot that showed the set fully. I took the handset from one of the other images where the model was holding it, clone stamped out her hand and added it to the image. So that's pretty much how I created this image. Even though it was a simple concept and fairly simple to put together, I feel the look is quite intriguing. 